So I was riding on engine 16, our rescue vehicle. We had a simulated MV-22 engine fire. We arrived on scene. The crash trucks put out the fire in the engine. The rescue crew went inside, got five casualties, brought them out with brought them medical care. A, a large scale exercise like this, we try to do on at least one time during the rotation, preferably at the beginning, uh, because once you wait till the end, it's obviously too late. But uh, so a lot of that training gets crammed in at the beginning. So we try to do a, one major one on each aircraft set that we have here if possible. Um, otherwise, we just do daily training uh, based on our mission. Every fireman joins it to be hands-on. We're all hands-on, so as long as we're capable of doing hands-on exercises, 100% of the time, that's what we do. Working with all branches in the military, it gets us familiar with protocols, procedures that everybody does with our actions and how we handle things on scene to the handoff of patients or casualties to medical care really helps for a real world scenario. Today went uh, really well and as my perspective we hit all of our benchmarks which is almost a checklist for fighting a fire even though every situation is different um, but we have three or we have main object objectives that we do meet on virtually every scenario and uh, today we accomplished that.